So what do I do with the mushroom fruiting bodies when I make my mixes? So this is reishi. As you can see, it's pretty powdery, which is why I don't add it to my masks. But I am not one to waste, so instead I'm making an exfoliator. So I have added the reishi mushroom, I have added some brown sugar, some vegetable glycerin, and some of the oils that I make, reishi oil and ginger oil, and I'm mixing that together with a little bit of water. The reason why reishi is so good for your skin is because they have adaptogenic effects. And an adaptogen helps your skin work at a molecular level or helps your body work at a molecular level to adapt its natural responses to stress. And they also contain something called beta-glucan polysaccharides that help promote your skin's ability to retain water, which means it's very hydrating. So I first just put on some warm water to open up my pores and then I am scrubbing, but any with any scrub, you wanna make sure that you're not scrubbing too hard because it can cause tiny little scratches on your skin, which makes your skin appear even worse. So be gentle. And then I'm rinsing it with warm water first and then with cold water, drying it off. And then I'm just using witch hazel as a toner. I am also making a rose water and witch hazel toner, but I can't put that on my shop quite yet. Um, but that's what I'm using here to finish cleaning out my pores. And then I'm using a little bit of a face serum that I'm also in the process of developing. And bam, there you go. Feeling fresh and clean.